We've had a question sent into the Whiteley Clinic website from Denise in Godalming asking why varicose veins are bulgy and curly. Well, Denise, normal veins in the legs are rarely seen as veins and certainly shouldn't bulge. If you are very, very fit and very, very slim with not much subcutaneous fat, you might see the veins themselves, particularly around the ankles. But usually normal veins are seen uh, rarely, and if they are, just as a bit of green on the surface. Varicose veins are caused when the underlying veins that cause them lose their valves. And when that happens, when you stand up, blood falls down the deeper veins and out through the little veins near the surface, eventually causing the walls to both distend, which makes them curly, and also get wider, which makes them bulge. It's this constant battering from the inside that used to be just thought of as pressure, but actually it's this constant backward flow, and I suppose you can think of it as an impact pressure, this constant pushing outwards that ends up getting the veins to elongate, and that makes them very, very serpentine, and dilate, which makes them bulge and stand away from the subcutaneous fat bulging through the skin. And when we see these bulging, wiggly veins, that's of course what we call varicose veins. What's most important to remember though, as always, that's not the problem. The problem is the underlying veins that cause that, the ones that's lost their valves. And that's why it's essential to have a duplex ultrasound scan to find out what's actually causing the problem in the inside.